A naked intruder caused a frenzy in one Albuquerque neighborhood. Police say first he broke into a woman's home, then holed up inside a nearby vacant home, causing an hours-long standoff. News 13's Madeline Schmidt is here with the story. Yeah, well, Jessica, today we were taken inside that vacant home and saw the remnants of this standoff. Neighbors called the whole thing weird and scary. There's keys in there. Uh, there's a um, wallet. There's a phone. A few clues remain as to what happened at this home near Zuni in San Pedro Wednesday afternoon. This man asked us not to use his name or show his face. He's the one who rents out this unit even though he doesn't live in it right now. It was not someone that I know from the neighborhood uh, or from the, uh, uh, the streets. Uh, we do have transient people uh, walk through um, Zuni. Police say 33-year-old Kenneth Harrelson was hiding inside the man's closet and refused to come out. The renter believes Harrelson snuck in through this backyard window, but this isn't why police were initially called to this neighborhood. Officers were originally dispatched to one apartment uh, in response to a man who had entered a female's apartment uh, unannounced. According to the criminal complaint, Harrelson first went into a nearby woman's apartment with no clothes on. She ran out the back to safety, called 911. That's when Harrelson fled into the man's rental down the street. The man says the standoff went on for about two hours until Harrelson was pepper sprayed and dragged out of the house. I have uh, no idea if he had his stuff stashed here and returned here to uh, get dressed. Nearby neighbors were spooked at the thought of a naked intruder. I'm sure he was either insane or he's on drugs or something. Now, officers say Harrelson was wearing clothes when they finally got him out of the home. He has been charged with breaking and entering. Jessica, back to you. All right, thank you, Madeline. Court records show Harrelson has been in trouble a handful of times this year. He's been convicted of shoplifting and trespassing.